in the year 20XX AD. The first annual robot tournament was held. with eight of the world's most powerful robots. But... Mr. X, the sponsor of the tournament, took control of the robots and began to take over the world. Mr. X, why? It's time to tell you the truth. I have been manipulating that fool, Dr. Wily, from the beginning. But now I no longer need Dr. Wily's help. Come and face my power, Mega Man. We'll stop you. Follow me, Rush. Rawr. Howdy, 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 everybody! I am Gomer the Ranting Thespian, and welcome to Mega Man 6 uh, The Redo! So wait, what the hell is a redo, and why am I doing it? Well, the redo series is basically games that I've done before, that I've posted and, and all that, but I'm not quite satisfied with how they turned out. Usually they're like older runs, older videos, or whatever. And while I still keep them up there, in case you guys want to see them, because there might be some fans who want to check it out and see where I've come from, etc. Um, with games like Mega Man or even Zelda 2, I could do things a little bit better, a little bit more efficiently, and, you know, a little bit closer to the style that I like to do for videos like this. Um, I actually thought of it after I did my initial Mega Man 7 run, uh, where I started segmenting these videos up into, like, one video per stage for longer or for shorter. Um, and so that kind of carried over into the redo series, and now up until this point, and, and even beyond, it's been one stage, two if it's like a short like intro stage or whatever, um, but like one or two stages per uh, video, depending on the depending on the length of stages. Um, sometimes I would bundle up two of them, like I think the end of Mega Man 3 I bundled up uh, the last two stages, for example, so, because I don't want like a two minute video, you know, that's, that's just mostly like credits and shit, you know, <laughs> so, um, but anyways, uh, so, so now you guys know, if you've, if you don't know before, you know what the Redo series is all about, so let's go, let's go, uh, weed some plants, plant some weeds, it's Plant Man, I don't know, uh, this stage, not, well, not, not too awful long, especially compared to Revenge of the Fallen, um, it has, what, what, um, oh god, it has an imbalanced, um, uh, checkpoint. And he's got an imbalance of flying. Anyways, imba checkpoint imbalance. You don't get very far in the stage before you get the one checkpoint outside the, the, uh, robot master room. And can I leap? Yes! Not to mention you also have Eddie right away. Fuck you, Eddie. I don't even need that. Why don't you give me something I need, you jackass? I say this and, and forget all the other times that Eddie actually has helped out. <laughs> and I know it's randomized, but still. Uh, by the way, welcome to the checkpoint. Welcome to the checkpoint, it's this early in the stage. The rest of the level you have to go through in all one life and one life on your own. Wow. I don't think I've ever tried to make a parody of that song. <laughs> yeah. Which includes a second mini boss battle with with the with the fucking monkey thing. Eh? Who now is deciding to spray shots at me? Great. So he's either gonna fist you or he's gonna spray you. Both of which could be very sexual. <laughs> ah. Hi. Oh! Ah, uh, yes. Continuing the tradition of having random things just pop out of pits to kill you. In this one, we have fishies. Lovely. And these platforms are cool. Uh, you know, you shoot, you get an instant platform. Yay! And I think they stay that way until you, like, scroll them off or something. They don't go away while, at least not while you're on the screen, so. Ooh. And little energy fruits. Has somebody, like, made, like, treats based on those? If not, they need to. Whee! Whoa! Oh! Yeah, I'm going through all this, and I'm thinking, okay, how the hell are you not supposed to take any damage? Then I remember Rome Mithril actually perfect ran, ran this stage. 
Ow. Whee! There we are. Ah. I don't remember his rating for this one. But I'm sure but I'm sure I could probably watch it later and find out. Ooh. Dyna well, I don't want to say dynamic, but like dramatic. Boss entry. Whee! Hi! Hi, your pattern is easy. <laughs> and you have the worst barrier weapon in the game. Or at least for me it is. Oh yeah. In this game, I don't think it extends to any other games. I, I, it might have been it might have originated in Mega Man 5. Um, I guess, you know, I don't have that in front of me, especially while I'm trying to blast Plant Man and turn him into, into smokable weed. Um, but at any rate, um, but yeah, the whole lose your charge shot when you get hit. Yeah, that's a pain in the ass. But hey, Plant Man's down, so good. Hooray! And we get the worst barrier weapon in the series. Seriously, it's it's among the worst, right up there with Skull Barrier. They look neat, but they, they kind of suck. Um, what can I say? You have flower petals just swirling around you. Ah, uh, I might try and make a little bit more use of it in this series, just to kind of see what it can do. And so you guys can, so we, so we can discover together whether or not my charge of it being the worst barrier weapon in the series actually holds true. <laughs> Outside of fighting Tomahawk Man. Um, so yeah, that is Plant Man down. We got seven more Robot Masters to go. Ah, uh, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did like it, hit the like button. And hey, if it's connected to social media and everything, it'll also share these videos around. Amazing. Uh, also subscribe if you want some more, and of course, if you, if, I, I do appreciate feedback, right down there, you can do that. And if you want to help more directly, uh, go to patreon.com slash gomer 21 double x throw some money at me, that'll, uh, at least at this point I'm looking to have it just kind of pay for itself, <laughs> a little bit. Um, which, hey, you know, that, that, that's not a, not always a bad thing. Um, and of course, if you throw enough money at me, then, uh, I'll put some ad space in the, I'll put your stuff, like, in the, in the, in the ends of these videos. You're gonna see what I mean in just a few seconds, because I already does that. Uh, so at any rate, thank you guys for watching, and until next time, this is Gomer, the Ranting Thespian, signing off.